Business Catalyst has made it really easy to create new web forms. And speeding up development is one of the biggest reasons why we love Business Catalyst. However, if you want to make style changes to a web form, that can often be challenging, or at least time consuming. Fortunately, Business Catalyst has sort of a hidden solution for handling that. I'm Scott Reynolds with Thrise and Presto BC, and I'm going to show you how to create a web form that is automatically styled the way you want it as soon as you create it. It's pretty common when you create a web form to start out by clicking Add Web Form, naming the web form, and then start adding fields from the web form builder. And then once it's done, you take the HTML that Business Catalyst gives you, you embed it on a page, and then you start to customize it. You would do things like change the tags to divs, add your own CSS, move things around until it looks the way that you want it. This is a pretty intuitive workflow, but I'm going to suggest that you start by actually creating the web form first. So here I've styled a standard HTML web form using Bootstrap 3. And if you look at the markup, you can see it has nothing that BC would need for it to work. It doesn't even have an action URL. This is just Bootstrap and not set up for Business Catalyst, except I did name some of the fields like first name, last name, and email. So what we can do is we can just copy this, go to any page, and in the HTML, paste it, click update, and then up here in the more actions, there's a little known feature hidden away called optimize content. This will detect that there is a form on this page and it will automatically create a new Business Catalyst web form and change the form in the HTML to make it work, including adding a new action URL. And if we go look at the web forms that are in Business Catalyst, our new form has been created. And if I click on that, you'll see that all of our fields are here. And when I go to the page that our web form is on, this is what we have. Let's see if it works. And it looks like it worked. So the next time you make a web form, consider reversing the way you typically make web forms. Style the web form first using HTML and CSS. And then when you're happy with it, add it to a page, use the optimized content feature, and let Business Catalyst do the work for you.